Hey guys, Kyle Demon here, Bullion RV, Duluth, Minnesota, and today we have for you a brand new 2022 Keystone Bullet. It's a 287 QBS, it's got a bunkhouse. Walk around the outside, we'll get you inside, we'll see what you think. Beautiful day here in Duluth, moving into the middle of September. Sun's out, perfect, mid 60, 70 degree weather. Just arrived, this bullet. It is a nice, good looking unit. So, we'll walk you around, let's we'll see what you guys think. Up front, we'll start up here with this big awning. Covers a nice campsite here. You got your pass through storage right up front as well. You can see the light on the other side. You got a nice little pegboard in here. I don't know if you can see that. Well, try to get the light going. A little pegboard. Hang some of your tools. You can see the aluminum frame construction in here as well. You also have a really nice little push puck light in here. Back around the front side. You got a nice rock guard down below. Good fiberglass front cap. Right down here is where your battery is going to live. We're going to throw a battery in a battery box in with the purchase. We're going to fill the propane tanks. You got two 20 pound tanks on board. You got a power tongue jack here as well. This is prep for solar. You also have a little solar plug down here too. Come around the back side. This is where your water station is. So easy hookups in here. And this does have the electric stabilizer jack so just push button right on this bay as well you got hot and cold water out here as well really nice back up one big slide on this unit get your dinette and couch in that slide you can see all the big beautiful windows bringing in all that natural light coming around the back it's equipped with a uh, spare tire here for you and also get this up here you can see this backup camera ready and I'll prep for that as well walkable roof so you can get up on the roof check your seals coming back around on the campsite again you got a really nice outdoor camp kitchen two burner cooktop here nice little fridge for beverages condiments <clears throat> so you're not running inside all the time dual axle really nice set of rims again under this awning let's see if we can get up there we got the lights on but i don't think you can see them out in the daytime really nice led strip that runs under the whole length of the awning you got outdoor speakers out here you got a spot if you did want to bring a TV out, put it out here with your appropriate cable hookups and the power to plug it in. Like I was saying, this is the 287 QBS by Keystone. Let's see. The unloaded vehicle weight of this trailer is 6,100 pounds. So with the newer half tons, a really nice Nice towable trailer here. Solid steps. Bring all the way down with a really nice big grab handle. Also, a friction hinge door on the front too. Kind of just set that in place, leave it there. All right, we'll bring it in now. Where as you walk in to the right, you got your master bedroom. You got the dual entry door. It's a little tight in here on the either side, but you got a spot you can put laundry chute or if you want to access, access some of the stuff from the storage area really nice wardrobe space in here as well with good pull out drawers it's a lot of room let's we'll see if you can see on that side you got little cubby holes behind it on both sides you got usb you got 110 you got a little shelf if you see a little black dot you can kind of run your cables up through there and leave a cell phone or a device up there to charge Overhead storage on here as well. Got a bright light on here. Whoa, <laughs> strobe light. First time using this camera, kind of getting used to it all. Um, AC ducted in here, then you do have the sliding doors. Really nice. And then you pop up the bed, and you're going to have more storage under the front of the bed, too. 
Right under the sink as you walk in, you got some nice storage here as well. And also right by the front door, you have, check out your tanks, got your slide outs, you got your awning, um, you got your lights, your water, everything's right there. Nice name brand insignia TV, you got the Furion sound system, cabinet doors below and above. And I believe there is a nice little light in there as well. So, cool little accent lighting back there. I really like that. Like I said, here's that one big beautiful slide. The dinette table. The couch will fold out into sleeping and the dinette will drop down. I don't know if you can see the roof, but it also has the curved roof in it. it gives you a lot more headroom, like four to six more inches. So for you taller folks, this will be feel really comfortable in the travel trailer. Those windows. You got storage that's going to be under. And then no carpet throughout. We gotta mention that uh, you got this like marine grade style carpeting. But if you have any pets, you know the kids, it's not easy to clean, wipe up. Really nice feature there. 12 volt refrigerator. Moving to the 12 volts. I mean, I've had this thing plugged in now for six and a half minutes and the freeze is already getting cold. So, nice benefit to the 12 volt. No more waiting overnight, two days to get the fridge cold. It's keeping cold as you're running down the road, hooked up to the truck, just really nice feature right there too. Nice little kitchen with the one big basin sink with the cover. Got this push puck style power pack right here. Two plug-ins, GFCI, USB. Three burner cooktop. Nice little accent lighting. Little oven. And then storage down below as well. Really nice. And then if you want, you do have more plugins right up top here. And then the cabinetry next to the microwave. So you kind of just got little storage doors everywhere. Coming back right before you get into the bunk room, you got storage back here with these adjustable shelves. So you can make these however you want to take them all the way out if you want, hang some clothes, put the shelves in there, however you want to do it. Really nice. Nice little storage down there as well. Turn you around. You got the big bathroom in here. You got a nice little tub, so if you got kids, you can pop them in there. Porcelain stool in here, really nice residential. Good counter space, plug-ins, and then a nice little shelf down here. And then more storage up under the sink. And then you do have a really nice medicine cabinet. And again, with that routed roof, it gives you a lot more headroom in the shower, too. You can kind of see that. You got a nice fan above there. Little things like towel hooks already included. Sliding back into the bunk room. I really like this area. The kids, you can see it's dropped down right now, but the kids can have their own little table back here to play some games, have lunch, you know, and then duels as extra sleeping. You can pop this up to give you more headroom when you are down there, which is really nice. Uh, windows all around, AC back here, nice vent. Um, so you get really good lighting. You do have a spot to put a TV if you want. Um, and then a lot of storage back here for the kids too. And then they all have, you know, USB. It's going to be on all of them. Kind of show you that. Which is really nice. So, this is the bunk space. I'm kind of turning around and show you. We like the light colors with the darker wood. Really makes it feel nice and open. Really makes the space a lot larger. Um, and again, with no carpet, um, that's really a really nice feature there too. So, I spin you around. 
I'll show you one more thing. I really like about these new tables they're coming out with too, that there's no pedestals under there. It's just on this mechanism. You know, you can just you know, push the table down, drop it into a bed. You don't have to find a spot for the bars. You know, at the end of the night, you don't gotta put the bars in and mess with those. Just pull it back up. Really cool, easy and convenient. Nice new feature that they have going on. So there you have it guys. My name is Kyle Dimmon. I'm here with Bullion RV. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out at 320-290-5834. You can text or call that number at any time. Be happy to answer any questions you have. Have a great day. Hope to talk to you soon.